Saint Symphorian, martyr. Here Philoweth of Saint Symphorian. Symphorian was born in the city of Augustiginans. And he being a young child shone in so great abundance of virtues, that he surmounted the life of the ancients. And as the Paynims hallowed the feast of Venus, Symphorian was there and would not worship the image to fool Heraclius the provost. And then he was long beaten, and after set in prison. And they would have constrained him to do sacrifice, and promised to him many gifts. He answered and said, Our Lord can well reward the merits, and also he can well punish the sins. Then the life that we owe to God of debt, let us pay with good will. Slow penance is to understand, sinners entered and be anointed with the sweetness of honey, which engendereth venom and thoughts evil believing. Your covetous to for all things possesseth nothing, for it is bounden to the arts of the devil, and shall be withholden in the bounds of the cursed and evil winning. And your joys, when they begin to shine, shall be broken like glass. And then the judge, fulfilled with wrath, gave sentence, and commanded that Symphorian should be slain. And as he was led to the place of his martyrdom, his mother cried from the wall of her house, and said, Son, son, remember thee of the life perdurable, look upward and behold him that reigneth in heaven. The life shall not be taken away from thee, but it shall be changed into a better. And then he was then and beheaded, and his body taken of Christian men, and was honorably buried. And so many miracles were showed at his tomb that it was held in great honor of the Paynims. Gregory of Tours rehearseth of the place where his blood was shed, a Christian man bare away three stones which were best print with his blood, and put them in a case of silver, and tables of tree enclosed about it, and bare them into a castle, which castle was all burnt with fire. And that case was found whole and safe in the middle of the fire. And he suffered death about the year of our Lord two hundred and seventy. Amen.